So, while you're on the probulator, tell me what brings you to the future. Oh, well, I wanted to meet Shakespeare, and I figured that time was cyclical. Nope. Straight line. Ah, the probulator's done. Oh, that wasn't so bad. Oh, wait. It hasn't started yet. Ah! <laughs> oh! ah. Okay, it's about to start. Hey, buddy. I'm looking for fresh slug. Yellow or purple? Whatever. The purple one causes terrible nightmarish diarrhea. Yeah, yeah, either one's fine. Dear horse god, I know I don't usually pray to you. Sometimes I doubt you even exist. But if you're willing to grant me luck, please, stamp your hoof once. <laughs> Come on, number six, move it! <sighs> don't do that! What are you... <sighs> Man, it's contagious. Uncle Vladimir! Come, Bender. You like being dead. That's what they said about being alive. You jerk! Why'd you have to drag us along? I wanted to watch you remember me. Did you really think you'd need all this junk in the afterlife? Afterlife? <laughs> If I thought I had to go through a whole nother life, I'd kill myself right now. And it only breaches into our 3D universe to hunt and fill its lungs with vacuum. Whatever its beef is, our one mission now is to get that monument to Earth. <laughs> Correction. Our one mission now is to avenge the loss of that monument. Leela's going nuts, and I can't save her unless I learn more about her mysterious past. Isn't there anything else you can tell me? Nah, nothing that wouldn't be a waste of your time. That's impossible, because my time is worthless. You boys have been underfoot long enough. You jerked the words right out of my mouth. We're their fathers, and it's high times we acted like it. Ooh, here comes violence. <clears throat> Get a job, you lazy kids. <sighs> uh, I guess if you want children beaten, you have to do it yourself. Look. I don't care if there's horse manure in it. That's good. I want to buy this franchise. How does a hundred thousand dollars sound? Forget it. We come to Earth to make a pizza, not the money. No, Blech. Other way around. All oh, right. Offer accepted. Certain clues suggest that the culprit is none other than our own Philip J. Fry. <laughs> what? Oh, it was a brilliant scheme, but you made one fatal mistake. Leaving this confession note. Fry, you scoundrel! Oh no, it's the Cyclops! Don't look, don't look! I'm not looking! <gasps> this is Officer 1BDI, requesting backup. We'll be there in five minutes. Wiggles, weren't you about to propose a toast to your gallant captain? Fine, I've got a toast to Captain Bender. He's the best! At being a big jerk who's stupid and his big ugly face is as dumb as a butt. Nah, eh, I've heard better. Well, enough about Hermes. I couldn't win a medal either. Even at bending, the thing I was built to do. I'm so embarrassed. I wish everybody else was dead. This opera's as lousy as it is brilliant. Gah! <laughs> <laughs> Lyrics lack subtlety. You can't just have your characters announce how they feel. That makes me feel angry. Hey, Banda, you ever kill a man with a sock? It ain't so hard. I better carve a ship for protection. Back in my day, we didn't have your fancy all digital weapons, but we still managed to kill each other just fine. Did you drive much in the 20th century, Fry? Nope. No one in New York drove. There was too much traffic. Nice. Listen to that baby purr. There's a baby in there, huh? Puny human number one. Puny human number two. And Morbo's good friend, Richard Nixon. Hello, Morbo. How's the family? Belligerent and numerous. Good man. Nixon's pro-war and pro-family. Yeah. 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 Great. First he steals my body, now he's touching my stuff. As it was, so it is. You may now eat the snake. 
<laughs> if you so choose. <laughs> Bender, is this salt water? It's salt with water in it, if that's what you mean. Uh, my vision's fading. I think I'm gonna die. There was nothing wrong with that food. The salt level was 10% less than a lethal dose. Uh-oh. I shouldn't have had seconds. This is mighty strange. First, the civilization of space Rome collapsed. Then, Don Martin III went kaflooey. And now, Tweenus 12. Looks like this planet is next in line. That's Earth. The planet we live on? I'd hate to be those guys. I remember my body. Flabby, pasty-skinned, riddled with phlebitis. A good Republican body. God, I loved it. I hear that. I spent most of my teen years loving my body. Of course, it was tough love, but... Ooh. Calling all scientists. Calling all scientists. Be advised there will be a worldwide conference on global warming in Kyoto, Japan. I've got a degree in homeopathic medicine. You've got a degree in baloney. Hmm. No! I could fit if I didn't have these damn arms. You gonna eat that? Maybe later. Uh, g uh, getting back to the uh, matter, uh, uh, if it please the court, Fry, there's nothing else here. You only wrote two pages of dialogue. Well, it took an hour to write. I thought it would take an hour to read. Of course, even if it is possible to analyze the message, there's no way of knowing how long it would take. It could take an hour, or it could take a hundred million years. Is it done? Certainly not. Two dings means it's done. But not like that. Slightly more rapid. <gasps> Let's see. Which powers do we have? Super strength? Ah! Yep. Uh-huh. Lickety speed? Check. Yes, sir. Ability to command the loyalty of sea creatures? Hey, Zoidberg, get in here. Screw you. Ain't got that. Nope. Tell the slaves. They can all go... F go faster? I told them, but they're so damn lazy. No. I mean, they're all free. Freeloading off you? I agree. No, I... <laughs> Pharaoh Hamenthotep is dead. <laughs> He's whipping angels now. As long as nothing happens for the next 15 minutes, our insurance will be reinstated. So let's just sit quietly and run out the clock. Ah! A giant sausage! Ah! Oh, God, no! Get out of here, you horrific sausage! Wait, isn't today the parade? It's just a giant balloon! Giant balloon? Ah! <laughs> Some doomsday machine! It barely killed anyone! Oh, yeah? Well, take this! Oh, my. Poor Leonardo da Vinci. He sure was stupid.